Okay, so hello folks and welcome. So I was just uh, going through some of my uh, stuff from a while ago and I noticed that I had this one right here, which um, is currently, if you do uh, that calculation, it comes out to I think about 750, like in USD, um, which is kind of crazy. Um, but, you know, obviously there's no way to sell it because it's tied to your specific account. So, um, that's kind of annoying. But anyways, the website itself looks, like, really, uh, not sketchy, but, like, just... <laughs> you basically have to go to GitHub, download something called 2110, and so I downloaded, I uh, yeah, this, the Win14. And then you open up this right here, which um, is tied to this thing right here. Um, oh, you also have to open up the thing inside the Win14 folder. Uh, it's like just whatever the .exe is. But anyway, so that all brings up. Um, so I, I opened it up. I went through dashboard. You know, added some uh, pairs to it. Um, when you add something to here, you're going to be adding, um, leave through here, no, through the profile. So you add a whole bunch of stuff in here, and then it all goes down to this little connected exchanges right here. This wallet is the wall, it's like, you know, it's kind of like your public wallet just as long as you have something that contains the tokens. Um, so again, like, you know, this is just the license here. Um, again, like, you know, the key, it's like, doesn't matter if I show it because it's not the private key, which, it, or not the uh, private key, it's, the, it's not the secret. I guess that's the terminology. But anyways, I don't even know if this is working or not. I loaded it to have, um, I loaded it so that it would like have, um, there's like 50 bucks. I changed it to USDC and then I opened up for ETH and ADA. Um, nothing seems to have happened yet, but you know, it keeps saying like, you know, all good. So I guess I'll just leave it like that for the time being. And yeah, so I'm going to close this. So here's, like, see here, I mean, like, nothing seems to have happened there. I'm going to try to go back to the, so it's USDC and then go back to the F. Yeah, I mean, see, nothing's happening here either. Um... I mean, again, like, though, you, you know, it's kind of amusing thinking probably most of the people here that are, like, using something very similar to what I'm using. Whoa. Why did it get a funny color? Um, different color. Um. Yeah, but anyways, yeah, I, I will, I'll definitely, um, if I have any success with this, I'll make sure to make another video, show you all. Um, but yeah, so this is, um, this is, so, oh wow, it's not secure. Like that, I, I mean, everything just seems super, um, I don't, I don't know, just super kind of raw in this, I feel this is much more similar to um, HAAS bot, um, which is also like unearthly expensive. Um, I've also tried what's it, the Crypto Hopper and um, Three Commas. Those two are easy to use, but I can't really figure out how to use them. Um, only with the has 
online and gun theory have I really kind of gotten to a point where I'm kind of like, this seems like it might actually, you know, be doing something. I'm going to try refreshing the screen here. Maybe I'll just delete this and then refresh it. Ah. If I go over here. Maybe it doesn't like two of them open. Yeah, again, as I said, it's, um, you, you know, it, it feels very, um, I guess they've also got uh, degraded stuff here. But, yeah, anyways, again, as I said, if, if there's, like, any further on this, I'll make sure to let you all know. Um, I know a lot of people say just skip all this um, altogether and just go with, you know, buying and holding. I would say in general that's kind of the way I would go as well. But, I mean, if this darn uh, bot like, actually works, that would be really cool. And I will make sure to let you all know. Anyways, though, folks, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Bye.